everybody, how's it going? How are the kids? How's the wife? Uh, today we're going to be playing Secret, Exper Secret Experiments Mission 1. It's a game by Dive Games on Game Jolt. Uh, it's very loud and uh, hurts my ears. There have been numerous experiments performed on human test subjects in the United States that have been considered unethical and were often performed illegally without the knowledge, consent, or informed consent of the test subjects. This is one of them. Next. After the experiments failed, I was sent here to clean up. I must kill all test subject, uh, remaining military personnel, and find eight syringes with infected blood. Syringe, okay, that's what a syringe looks like. I'm glad it told me that. Also, loading. Oh, okay. At least it got quieter. Do I have a gun? How do I switch weapons? I guess I don't have a gun. Okay, let's take a look here. Uh, I don't know what that's even supposed to be. Maybe it's... I don't know. I'm not even gonna try. Was I sleeping here? Doesn't matter. Can I break these? They're physical, so I can, like, move them around a little bit. Is there secrets behind these? Oh, there is. It's probably not a secret. That's actually probably where I'm supposed to go. Let's go down here. Down, down, baby, down, down. Oh, God. You are all pink and gross and weird looking, aren't you? What happened to your lower half, dude? What happened? Also, you'll have to excuse my sniffling. I might be getting a cold. Oh, God. Holy crap, man, that's gross. Give me that shirt. Give me the, give, it, give it to me. What do I press to get it? F? Yes, it's F. What the fuck is that? It's like a mutilated dog or something. Your ribs are sticking out, man. You should see a doctor. It's not healthy. Okay, let's continue crawling in this vent. Very slowly. Seriously, though, do I have a gun or no? Because that's kind of a deal breaker. There are a lot of dead things. Oh, I have a wrench. Take that. And that, and that, and that, and that. Yeah. Okay. Okay, the weapon system's pretty good, actually. It's most indie games, like, most indie first-person shooters don't have that, so you've got that. <clears throat> Hello? Anybody? Oh. Hey there, buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> it's actually kind of creepy. What did I just pick up? You wanna... You wanna wrench to the buttocks? I know you do. Ha! Get wrecked. Why did I say get wrecked? I almost never say that. Stupid shit. Okay. Zombies are, uh... Not that hard to kill. Oh god. You sneaky developer, you. You s hey, I have 69 health now. Oh, I have a gun. I have some ammo for the gun. I can zoom in, but like that makes it worse. That makes it harder to aim. Oh yeah, health, nice. And uh, if I was, uh, if my eyes were recording visual information properly and sending it to my brain the right way, then my uh, my health regenerates on its own. Yeah, take that. Taste it. Taste the wrath of Smith and Wesson. American, American, uh, gun shooty thingy. I saw a dude up there. Right in the, right in the banana. Right, oh. Oh yeah, there's balloons. Not balloons, it's just soldiers. Oh, he's dead. He, he, oh god, they can jump. They, they, they've got hops. Very fast. Switch, okay. You guys are creepy. I'm out of ammo. Oh, no I'm not. Give me this. Can I get on this? Where's the, is that the, that's not a monitor. Where's the monitor for this? There's a keyboard and there's like all sorts of different contraptions, but there's no monitor. Very confused. Oh my god. Please don't, oh god, don't. Uh. Uh. It's been a while since I played an indie game. I don't- I think the last time I played one was, uh, October, actually. Can I break these? I guess not. Okay. 
I'm not missing syringes, am I? The description of this game said the map was pretty big, and that kind of that kind of like made me think, oh man, what if I what if I can't find them? God, I found you guys. It's not really what I'm looking for. Again, hitboxes could use some work, but all together, it's pretty good. Zooming in does nothing. Hold on, I gotta use my wrench. I don't wanna waste all my ammo. At least there's health right here on this barrel. Time. Oh. Okay. What time did I start recording? I don't know. I'm gonna go a few more minutes. I don't think this is gonna be like a like a 15 part series like opposing force or anything. It's just gonna be like two or three at most, hopefully. But yeah. Bang. 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 It's easiest to hit them in the crotch because they have such big balls. You now the collision boxes are easy. Is that ammo for my thing? That doesn't look like revolver. Oh, it's not. Oh, shit. I got an M16, baby. Again, the zoom. It could use some work. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, hey there! Alright, so, uh, so the game crashed. Uh, because it sucks at alt-tabbing, but in the process of crashing the game, I learned a valuable lesson. Uh, you can lay down by pressing C. Get on the ground. Uh, I don't know how that's useful, but... I'm sure there'll be a time and a place for it. Is this how I go down the ladder? Oh god! You sneaky son of a dick. Aiming down the sights does nothing. Okay, well he's dead. I can't believe... I can't believe you, Dying Games, for putting a trap like that down below the ladder. Dude, I hate the fast one. It's fast coming at me like too quick. I really react. It's just. I swear to God, if I die and have to start over, I'm gonna be livid. Give me these bullets. Got a lot of. Got a lot of revolver ammo now. Just take these magazines out of your. What the fuck is that? Oh my. Oh. That's actually disturbing. It's like a person's head on a dog body, but he's got like people hands. Uh, oh, there's a syringe. Really? Are they going to be that obscure to find? It's going to take forever. Alright. Well, we must carry on. We must do the do. We must, uh... What's another phrase for keep going? Must uh, be a trooper. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna stop. Is this all that I can do here? Can I get up top of this barrel and like jump on top of the walkway? Uh, can I lay down and go under? Yeah. Found a use for laying down, guys. Okay, so there was a syringe down there and a and an M16. Uh, I didn't go this way yet. There's more stairs. And more zombies. <laughs> I love ragdoll physics, man. I've always been... I've always been, uh... Fond of them. God, the hitboxes are just not the best that I've seen. You just back off, bucko. Don't even think about eating my my brains. So hold on, the story of this game goes, I'm a dude who uh, has come to this place where they're doing experiments that are inhumane and disgusting and illegal to just kill everybody. I'm pretty sure killing everybody is like more, uh, is less humane than, well maybe it isn't, but it's not any better than fucking conducting experiments on people that are unwilling. This is like the pr plot of Resident Evil, one of the games at least. It's gotta be. I really like Resident Evil. I even liked uh, Revelations 2, and a lot of people didn't like that. 
I kind of enjoyed it. I never beat it. I got to like the very end and didn't even beat it. There are so many games that I beat like two thirds of the way through and never complete. Uh, one of they were. Uh, I did it with The Witcher 3 when they came out. I did it with Fallout 4. I did it with. I did it with. Uh, there's a couple of Revelations too. I don't know why, dude. I, don't know. I guess I just fail to keep my interest. I got high standards. I don't even. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Another fast one. It's okay. I got this. There was health back here. I'm gonna. Excuse me. I'm gonna go grab that. Reload the fucking gun, man. Um, I know there's gotta be health that I didn't grab. Oh, there's a oh, 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 one of those, huh? Yeah, right here. Okay, now I'm ready, and so is my M16. I think these are all the guns that are in this game: is the wrench, the revolver, and the M16, and that's fine. I don't need that many guns to find eight syringes and kill zombies and soldiers. Actually, in Opposing Force, they had like nine guns to kill zombies and soldiers, but that's a different that's a different game. I guess the sights kind of work, not to like where I'd put my life in them. What do I mean by? That? I mean like not that I'd use it in a print in a pinch, but they're definitely not as bad as I initially thought. There's another soldier down there. Or not? Okay. I'm pretty sh oh, easy there, drum. I am pretty sure that I forgot what I was even gonna say. It happens to me all the fucking time. You're dead. That's what you get for only arming your men with revolvers. M16 and a wrench, additionally. Yeah, I see. You think I don't see you? There's, oh my god, he's... I've never seen a zombie do that before. God, the gunshots are actually really loud. I, my microphone might be might be picking them up through my headphones. There's a syringe, and that guy's... There's bullets in your crotch. Give me this. Give it to me. Okay. Can I go up this lad... Oh, up this uh, up this elevator lift, or is it just here for decoration? I'm pretty sure it is just here for decoration. Also, you may notice that like my flashlight doesn't work on all the walls. That's because the graphics are on the highest setting and they're not supposed to be for this game because the um, I guess the highest like graphical texture settings weren't added in. So yeah, that's fine though. It's not really hindering my process or anything. Okay. Why is that zombie not attacking that bad guy? I'm gonna kill him first because soldiers are more more of a pain in the ass. Cause they have ranged attacks. You guys. Well, you are the best, so. There's a there's a plus for you guys and a minus for me. Okay. There is a thing here. Okay. You wanna play. That's what you get. You mess with the bull, you get the horns. They almost killed me actually. I shouldn't be shouldn't be bragging. Is there a syringe on this on this man dog? On this mog? On this Dan? That's a name. Uh I'll take these and I'll take these. I don't need health right now. I'll take those two. There's probably a syringe, yep. I've got six. Okay. Six out of eight blood samples. Was there a door down here? I have no idea. Let me just check the perimeter real quick. Nope. Alright. Back up the stairs it is. Where else do I go? I didn't see any other branching paths. I guess I'll take a look. Oh, there's a stamina system in this game. I did not know that. The more you know. So I went this way and there was a lift that didn't exactly work um, let me go see if that'll actually work and I wasn't just missing something or if there's something behind these barrels or boxes fucking oh 
Unity Engine physics are, um, not the best, but they can be programmed to be pretty good. Uh, 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 no, there's no button here. There's no salvation. So this, this, this place is a dead end. I need to go back. And what kind of place is this? The walls are like brick. There's like metal walkways. If it was like a science lab, then is that a bump map or is that actually... I think that's an actual like 3D thing. But there's like brick, brick walls with like metal infused in them. And like metal walkways that are graded. And I don't see a lab anywhere, a chemistry station, so how can they make infectious diseases? God, you guys are just gross. Oh, oh wait, that's where I came from. Did I go here? E yes? Yeah, this is where I got my my M16, my M16. My standard issue American assault rifle. What's behind this? Nothing. Again, sorry for the for the sniffling. Just a little bit sick. I can cope though. Did I go here? Is this where I came from or I'm pretty sure it is actually. Yep. This is where I started. The same fucking five minute track keeps looping in my ears and it's not it's not doing me good man let me tell you nothing there nothing there okay so these don't do anything when I hit them do they oh are you serious okay so there's one more somewhere I can find it I have faith I can find it and complete this in one episode it's not gonna be on this, is it? On any of these, shouldn't be. Okay. Well, I'm glad since they uh, since they make us look for eight syringes um, that are sometimes very obscurely hidden, that they at least gave us, or he or she at least gave us a smooth movement system to to unrustle our jimmies. So the syringes gotta be. Somewhere, somewhere in this level. It's somewhere in this 3D environment. Yeah, and this barrel? No. I swear to God, if it's like in one of these tiny divots in the walls, I'm gonna flip my shit. Um. It's not up there. Did I find any? I found one down here, right? It could be another. If I only found one. went through there. I didn't go through here. Actually, I did. I found one syringe in here. It was on... It was behind this mattress. Okay, so it's not in there. Let's go... Security shield. Break it? I don't think I can. I, these don't open, do they? If they open the whole time, I'm just dicking around. They don't open. Any syringes here? No, it doesn't look like it. Under the table. Crouch down. Nope. Um, under the barrel. No. Okay, let's double back here. Go some other place. Look for them. Yep, climb up the ladder. Good boy. Oh my god, the, the looping track is like 30 seconds long. It's driving me crazy. I feel like I'm taking crazy pills. Did I say crazy pills? I'm at crazy pills. Is there a Could I break this body and find the syringe inside of his intestines? I doubt it. It's not under there. Gotta be in here somewhere. Um, mm, mm, I swear, if it's like the most obscurely hidden shit, if it's like in between a monster's butt cheeks, I'm, uh, I'm gonna 
be upset. I will be not happy. I, didn't, I don't think I found one here, did I? Actually, I think I did. Excuse me. Um, yeah, there was one in that monster. Does this work? Does this elevator work? I don't think it does. <gasps> that doesn't do anything. If there's a button on this broken texture and I can't see it because the graphical setting wasn't programmed, then that's too bad. I don't think it works anyway. I think that was just a place for him to put a soldier or her. Uh, it's gotta be. It's gotta be in this wing somewhere. I didn't check here too thoroughly. There was one down there, right? I found one. I don't want to move too fast because I might miss one if it's like on the ground, just laying there. Hello, syringe, syringy poo. Where are you? Um, it's not behind this. It's, it's not on this disgusting manimal or this half-body creep. The where? The fuck? Okay. I'm gonna pause the recording and then come back when I find it because I'm just gonna be recording for. A an hour and a half if I just keep going, so yeah. I'll see you in about two seconds. Maybe, maybe it's inside myself. Maybe this game plays on like a deep psychological like thing <gasps> where you search yourself for answers and through the existential crisis that is you finding the syringe, you find yourself. Maybe I'm just going batshit crazy because I can't find a tiny fucking infected blood syringe in this huge area. <gasps> That's probably right. <gasps> oh, are you fucking kidding me? There? Really? I can just- Alright. Alright, all blood samples collected. Collected 8 out of 8 blood samples. Yay me! Mission 1 was- a, was- was success. Are you ready for another one? Is there another one? No. There's no other mission. Okay. So, thank you for watching me play Secret Experiments Mission 1. I thought it was pretty good, except for the fact that the syringes were obscurely hidden, of course, but... I mean, you get what you get. Hold on. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, if you want some mindless zombie killing and soldier killing and finding things, then this is the game for you. It's pretty good. I'd give it like a like a seven out of ten, just for functionality, because it wasn't broken. So again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next next video, whatever I choose to play.